गुड इवनिंग फ्रेंड्स यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम टू थिंक आई चैनल टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग द क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स ऑफ एंथ्रोपोलॉजी आवर चैप्टर इज करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ प्राइमेट्स एंड अदर टॉपिक्स आवर क्वेश्चन इज रोल ऑफ प्राइमेटोलॉजी एंड एंथ्रोपोलॉजिकल स्टडीज फॉर ईयर्स प्राइमेटोलॉजी विच डील्स मेनली विद स्टडी ऑफ ह्यूमन प्राइमेट्स हैज बीन क्वेश्चन अबाउट इट्स प्रेजेंस इन एंथ्रोपोलॉजी एंड इट हैज बीन अ ब्लैक शिप of the family of anthropological study the likely reason for questioning on primatologist within anthropology stems from its historical association with socio biology during 1980s and 1990s but as anthropology is a holistic study of man and man is a member of order primates study of primatology is very much essential in anthropology role of primatology in anthropology first is to understand biological relationship between living and ancestral primates second study of primate behavior to understand human behavior more clearly third anthropology is based on holistic comparative approach and a comparative approach in primatology can move beyond a reductionist view of species behavior by identifying variation of behavior between population within a species fourth is study of primate social intelligence individual decision making and behavioral strategies to better understand human aging fifth is as anthropology stresses the significance of culture adaptation and social flexibility the study of primate flexibility and social complexity can help anthropology understand human evolution clearly sixth is comparative morphological study of man and non human primates complemented by biochemical analysis provided major clones to human bipedalism dextrin hand dextrin hands and bulbous head and jaw bulbous head and jaw seventh is wide range of adaptation of non human primates helps in understanding human erect posture and bipedalism eighth is free ranging primate free ranging primates exhibit true of physical and behavioral adaptation which remain which resembles that of human pleistocene predecessors or predecessors human pleistocene predecessors laboratory and field observation show similarities between cognitive abilities of great apes and pleistocene predecessors thank you very much